why did they create a camera cube? It looks so boring. I'm not going to wear this. I'm not going to use this out. So what do I need this for? So for the longest time, I really thought that Peak Design forgot about photographers. I just realized that I didn't know or I didn't understand where they were headed. And when I understood it, it just blew my mind. So hi everyone, this is Jiggy, a portrait and wedding photographer from the Philippines and welcome to the channel. So when I was conceptualizing this video, I decided to basically bring out all the Peak Design stuff that I have here in the studio. And I realized I did have a lot of their products. And at the same time, I know I sold a few of them too. Now, when Peak Design started, they were primarily made for photographers. They created fantastic looking bags that did not look like camera bags. And that's exactly what I was looking for then. I think that was in about 2015 or 16. I don't know the exact dates anymore. Now that bag is long gone. That's a Peak Design everyday backpack. And because I felt that it was a bit too cumbersome to bring around anymore already, so I decided to get this one, the Peak Design Sling, which is perfect for my mirrorless system. This is the A7C Mark II. As you can see, I also have a bunch of straps from Peak Design. This is the Peak Design Leash. This is the slide. I have the slide light right here. And I also have the cuff. So all of these things, oh, even the Peak Design tripod, which I bring along every time I'm traveling. That's why I was so in love with this particular company because I just created really innovative stuff for photographers. However, I think this was the last one. This Peak Design tripod was the last one that they created just for photographers. Afterwards, they started shifting to lifestyle. I was like, okay, I'll give it a shot. So I even have the Peak Design case for my iPhone. I even have this. This is the Peak Design mobile tripod. And another thing, even this one, the one from the Creator Kit. So I can slap on my iPhone here and put it maybe hanging here. However, it wasn't primarily meant for professional photographers anymore. Or by the way, I even saw this. I had this one. This is one of their first products also. This is where you could have your camera or your lenses attached to each side so that you could change it without any problems. I could hang this one here. Now, here's the thing. I just realized that Peak Design was shifting away from the photography industry, but rather creating more lifestyle content products, which I was totally on board with because I do like bags that don't look like photography bags. But for the longest time, I did not purchase any of those products because I felt that it wasn't really meant for photographers. Then they started creating beautiful new products again after a few years. And I ended up with this. This one was their Peak Design Duffel. Again, it's not meant for photog photographers, but they look fantastic. They even have a new line of these things that's just perfect for everyday lifestyle work. Then recently, they came out with this beautiful outdoor bag. And when they were saying that from the outdoors, they went to photography, then they went back to outdoors. So this is the first bag that I plan to buy from Peak Design once again, primarily for my camera, even if it wasn't built for my camera. Oh, by the way, this bag I got from a friend, Nico Valenzuela. I borrowed it from him for this particular video because don't you just think it looks fantastic. It's white here and sage. This is a 25 liter. This is part of their new series. This is the outdoor backpack. Now, again, as I said earlier, Peak Design, they created beautiful camera bags. They created beautiful stuff for photographers. Then they just shifted to lifestyle. And I realized that they actually had one particular product that I never really paid attention to that will put everything together. And what is that? It is this one, the Peak Design Camera Cube. I was like, why did they create a camera cube? It looks so boring. I'm not going to wear this. I'm not going to use this out. So what do I need this for? Then I realized that they've created this line so that we can use all of these beautiful bags that don't look like camera bags as a camera bag. Even this duffel for that matter. I can use this one. I can use a camera cube and put it in my duffel and make it seem as if I'm not bringing a camera. And that's why this particular bag became one of the most beautiful bags that I've ever seen 
that Peak Design created. First of all, look, if I don't want to use it as a camera bag, it's lightweight, it's so thin, but it also has a compartment for my laptop inside. Now, if you guys want a full review of this one, I'll put the link to Nico Valenzuela's video. She did an absolutely beautiful review in depth for this particular bag. But this is how I plan to use it. I'll have this bag like this. I'll put my 16-inch MacBook Pro. Yes, a 16-inch MacBook Pro fits here. Then I will just have the camera cube right there. Close it, and it becomes a camera bag. Now, if I don't want to use it as a camera bag, I just take this one out. It becomes like, oops, it becomes like an ordinary backpack. That's actually very stylish, even though if it was meant for the outdoor, it still looks fantastic. So all the while, I thought Peak Design forgot about us photographers. Then I realized they didn't. All they did was create even more beautiful products that caters to all aspects of photography life from the professional photographer to the lifestyle photographer to the outdoorsman. All of it was right here. All I needed to do was really just understand the direction of the company. And now I am back loving Peak Design once again. And one last thing, I forgot about two particular products that I actually use every day. It is the mobile wallet and this one. This is the packable tote. We keep this in our bag every day. So every time we're going to the grocery or we're going shopping, we don't need to get those plastic bags anymore or any of those um, bags that they give out whenever we're shopping because we just put it in here. So it's perfect for the grocery. It's perfect for basically anything. It's just this handy little recyclable bag. This is, a, or sorry, not recyclable, but reusable bag. Fantastic. And also as a disclaimer, this video is not sponsored by Peak Design. I just wanted to give you my thoughts about the direction of the company and the products that they've been creating and how I am totally loving every single one that they've created. So I hope you enjoyed this video and if you want to learn more about maybe photography or off-camera lighting, do check out the rest of the videos in my channel. Now if you want to see some of the work I've created, you could follow me in my social media sites on TikTok, Facebook, and Instagram, all at Jiggy Alejandrino. Okay, till the next video. After years of waiting and wondering why they didn't exist, they are finally here. Say hello to the Peak Design outdoor bag line. In this video, we'll talk about the two outdoor backpacks, the 25 liter and the 45 liter, as well as everything that they have to unpack.